If information communications technology ICT is to drive Nigeria and indeed Africa's digital economy, development and literacy in the nearest future, then the old students of CMS Grammar School, Nigeria's oldest secondary school with a tradition of excellence, made the right decision a few years ago to computerize and solarize the entire school. That phase was completed in due course and glad to say the entire school is wired with high speed dedicated internet, solar panels with inverter battery systems have also been installed and working efficiently. This has helped to bring technology closer to all the students, thereby expanding the scope of digital education in the school. When I was in grammar school in Odunami, we were using blackboard and, and chalk. Everything was done on papers, but the world has changed. A school cannot remain working on, uh, on blackboard. All high schools in America are computerized. That idea came to my mind when we were having a meeting and the education committee was talking about sending computers to the school. And I thought that there's no point sending computers to the school if there's no internet. And we must look at the whole thing globally. We really need to do total computerization and solarization of the school. At present, the school can uniquely boast to be amongst top secondary schools in Nigeria, well positioned for expansion into an institution offering ICT training in the nearest future. Our accomplishments for CMS Grammar School includes remote e-learning system and LMS uh, during the pandemic, 30 megabits dedicated fiber internet, which is best in class. All buildings now have wired or Wi-Fi internet. And then every classroom has an ethernet wall connectivity. For solarization, phase one, we have put solar panels on 14 buildings. For phase two, we put solar panels on five buildings. Inverters were installed to capture power for nighttime use, which provides us uninterrupted full power at the school. And we have minimized diesel cost for generators. The solarization program is giving us a great opportunity when there is power failure from Ikeja Electric. We have saved a lot of money in purchasing diesel. Our future projects include smart boards for every classroom, 1,000 tablet computers with e-learning content. For solarization, we are planning to provide phase three support for air conditioners and additional redundancy. Now, grand final project would be the ICT building, which is a vocational training building. There is no doubt that the future of Nigeria and indeed Africa will be driven wholly by information communications and technology. Nigeria's oldest secondary school, the CMS Grammar School has taken a very bold step to launch the building for an ICT center within the school. What is the purpose of our ICT building? Well, it is to prepare our students for a technology driven world and it will support a forward thinking curriculum. Uh, some of the key areas of focus of the building would be machine learning and artificial intelligence. There will be drone technology and digital media, robotics and telecommunication and sat satellite training. Uh, there will be computer hardware assembly and repair. And there will, of course, there will be a data center in the building. We are designing this building to be flexible and to be scalable as well, meaning that we can uh, uh, collapse different spaces and convert them to use for, for different purposes. Machine learning and AI. The classrooms will be equipped with high performance computing hardware, AI training models uh, available for practical learning and advanced software for data analysis and algorithm development. There will be dedicated spaces for drone a outdoor flight area for drone activities, and there will be a robotics lab. There will be hands-on programming of robotics systems, testing and assembly of robotic systems. There will be a space there for a hardware assembly and repair center. 
they will focus on telecommunications infrastructure and hardware design. And we will provide practical skills in hardware assembly, networking, and repairs. This will allow some of our students who choose not to go to higher education like universities, colleges, et cetera, to be able to have a skill when they leave CMS Grammar School. There will be a digital media lab at the school, uh, spaces for video editing, digital photography, and a green screen production. This will enable skills to, that would allow our students to, to develop in media creation and content production. Uh, have you ever heard about TikTok? Have you ever heard about YouTube? Have you ever, ever heard about Instagram? Well, a lot of these things are making money for people and we want our students to be prepared for the future. Please join us as we embark on this great project. Thank you. Um, we are moving into a digital era where we will need this type of knowledge. So I feel there is no reason why CMS Grammar School, the first secondary school in Nigeria, should not be exposed to this type of artificial intelligence. It's going to help us to um, benefit ourselves and even the people around us by the time we are living. So these buildings that we are putting into development, they are going to help input this knowledge of what we don't know yet into what we need in our lives. It has not been easy without the support of old students of the school based in the Americas, UK, Europe and Nigeria. The first and second phases of computerization and solarization were duly sponsored. The third phase, the ICT building is paramount in continuing the dream of churning out students well trained in ICT that will drive Nigeria's digital future. OGS America's computerization started in 2017 with the effort of our grand patron, Professor Sam Adebonojo. We came together and created four pillars related to computerization and solarization of the entire school. Computerization entails a number of things ranging from internet in the school all the way to having school provided computer tablets in the hands of every child. All of OGS has adopted this initiative and, and are working together. Uh, we urge everybody to join us in this effort. Nigeria's leadership position in Africa and indeed the world cannot be overemphasized. Nigeria needs to step up digital education at secondary school level to build a solid foundation for the future. OGS Americas, UK, Europe, and Central Body call on old students, friends, and associates to please key into this laudable project and donate. We are now in the last phase of this program. We want to finish what we started. Therefore, we need everyone to come around to help us to complete this project. When you do this, and when you join us, you will be joining a host of other people in helping CMS Grammar School continue its job, which is production of leaders all over the world, in Europe, in America, in Africa, in Asia. Grammarians are everywhere doing what they have to do to raise the bar of humanity and so this is one of those projects. Join us therefore on March 22nd, 2025, as we raise funds for the ICT building. May the good Lord bless you and keep you. Thank you. Hi everyone. I want to take a moment to acknowledge the incredible collaboration and teamwork demonstrated by OGS Central, OGS UK Europe, and OGS Americas on past projects. Despite being different groups, we came together as one for the solarization and computerization projects, united by a shared goal, the betterment of our great school, the CMS Grammar School. We didn't worry about who got the credit instead. We focused on working together to achieve something amazing. And that's exactly what we did. I'm proud to be part of this community known as the Old Grammarian Society and I look forward to seeing what we can accomplish together in the future. Thank you.
upschool up boys. The launching of our ICT project starts March 22, 2025. Gamerians all over the world, let's rise up and make our school proud. We're reaching out to family. We're reaching out to all our social media network. We're reaching out to friends. Stand up and rise up to the cause. Nisi Domino Foster, God bless you all. Thank you. Please join us on March 22nd for our global fundraising activities. Your contribution will bring us closer to our goal and will empower the next generation of leaders. Together, we can make a difference and ensure that our alma mater will continue to provide an exceptional education of our children and grandchildren for years to come. Thank you for your generosity and unwavering support. Society, OGS Americas, OGS UK and Europe, OGS Central Body cordially invite you to a Zoom virtual worldwide $2.5 million school computerization and solar power project phase 3 fundraiser. The computerization and solar power project includes 1. Solar power phase 3, 2. Smart TVs for every classroom and laboratory. 3. 1,000 tablet computers with e-learning contents and 4. Information and Communication Technology ICT Building Please join the Zoom Global Fundraiser slated for Saturday 22nd of March 2025 at 9 a.m. Pacific Time, 11 a.m. Central American Time, 12 p.m. Eastern American Time, London Time, 4 p.m. Lagos Time, 5 p.m. The Zoom Fundraiser Launch Meeting ID is 857-8035-3728. Passcode is CMSOGS. To donate, please use this link and also scan the QR code. Please come and be part of this historic fundraiser. Nigeria and indeed Africa will surely rise. Fail we not in high emprise. Up school. Oh boys.